Hey guys, Tech Mentor with a video for you guys in today's video. I'm going to show you a couple different ways to hide apps on your iPhone on the latest iOS version. So let's get started. So in order to uh, hide an app on your iPhone, the simple and the easiest way is most likely you're looking to hide it from your home screen. If that's the case, let's go ahead and pick an app. We'll pick Instagram, for example. We're going to press and hold just like that. And we'll click on remove app. Now, when you click on remove app, it's going to give us another message where we can remove it from the home screen without actually deleting it. So we click on that and now it's gone from our home screen. Now, of course, with this method, if you go all the way to the very last page under app library you can search up the app and it will show up the app is still there on your phone it just won't be visible on the home screen now the second method to hiding apps on your iphone is by hiding a whole complete home page so let's move some app to a new home page by pressing and holding right and then after that we can start dragging it so i'm going to drag it to a page like this one and pick out the apps maybe i want to hide so i point and then move it over and then we can keep on doing it for multiple apps just like that we can bring it up and we have let's say the list of apps that we want to hide we're going to hit that right there now we can see here there's multiple home pages and the one specifically that we want to hide we click on these again these three uh, dots or four dots whatever it is if you press on those it's going to show us all the home pages available and if we unselect this one hit done here now as you can see here if i go to the last page that page is not shown and those apps are hidden from our view again those apps are still there under app library you can search them up for example if i as you can see here if i search up one of them like x or the zoom right they, they will show up right here still installed on your iphone just not available or seen right at the home screen now a third option that you have is completely not showing the apps at all even in the app library in order to do that you go into your setting of your iphone this time we're going to use something known as screen time and under screen time there's content and privacy restriction we'll turn that on and if it's not turned on go ahead and turn it on and after that under allowed apps we can go ahead and turn off these individual apps themselves if we don't want it to be shown up for example if we don't want facetime we unselect that FaceTime will no longer show up. Let's go ahead and try that again one more time. Loud apps. As you can see here, now FaceTime is gone. Now, again, the same thing you can do for these apps. Now, these are the default apps on your iPhone. If you want other apps to be removed, like the ones from the third party one, it's going to work slightly different. You can go back under here. And this time, under your changes here for allowed apps, we're going to do click on content restrictions right under content restriction there's something called web content so if you do web content restriction what we'll do is for apps right under allowed apps under instead of the web content under your allowed apps right here we're going to click on the filter for apps that you don't want to show so for example each app has a rating for what age group it's appropriate for starting with 4, 9, 12, and 17. So if you were to select where the app is only for 7, 12 and up for example, right? And we go back, all the apps that are rated for that specific age group or higher, it will be removed from our screen here. And you can play around with it with different settings here. Now, when you do this, you it does take a moment for it to disappear. So sometimes you might want to lock the phone, open it up, and then you can observe to see that apps are being removed. As you can see here, I have less apps now that are showing because I selected that filter for only four plus and so. And you can play around with that. And of course, if you want to ever come back to show all the app, where you're going to say show, allow all, and all apps will come back again to your screen just like that so that's our different ways to hide apps on your iphone i hope this video was helpful if so please make sure to like and subscribe button thanks for watching guys see you guys next time